Joss Stone looked effortlessly chic as she put on an energetic performance at the London Palladium on Tuesday evening. The singer, 35, cut a stylish figure in a white floating halter neck gown adorned with black floral patterns as she took to the stage to belt out her popular tracks. She styled her brunette locks loosely in glamorous waves and accentuated her natural beauty with a slick of mascara and a touch of pink lipstick. Joss, who rose to fame with her 2003 multi-platinum debut album The Soul Session, accessorized her ensemble with a dainty silver bracelet. She tied a glittering gold scarf embellished with sequins to her microphone stand as she sang her heart out in front of her backing vocalist. Joss put on a very energetic display as she was seen throwing her hands in the air and flashing a huge smile to the audience. Her performance came as part of her much-anticipated 20 Years of Soul anniversary tour, which kicked off in February and will run through until July. Joss will take to the stage in an array of locations across the globe including Germany, Mexico, Spain, Switzerland, and Hungary. Her busy touring schedule comes after Joss detailed the traumatic labor she endured with her second child, Shackleton, who was born in October. She shares 21-month-old daughter Violet and 5-month-old son Shackleton with partner Cody Dalla. Speaking in December, she explained how she wanted to have a natural birth but underwent an emergency cesarean after laboring for 32 hours and being in pain. Her newborn son's heart rate dangerously plummeted and Joss said the doctors only had around 14 minutes to get the baby out alive. Joss told the son, my baby's heartbeat started dropping and I had this intense pain. I heard his little heartbeat go down and down. I said, something's happened to my baby. And the nurse grabbed the phone to call the obstetric emergency team. What I didn't realize at the time is that my uterus had split open and my baby's head was stuck in my abdomen. You only know it's happened because the baby's heart rate plummeted. And at that point, the doctors only have around 14 minutes to get your baby out alive. Following the surgery, Joss and her newborn son were both discharged after three days in hospital. Joss revealed she had a miscarriage last October before falling pregnant with Shackleton, which she described as not something you ever get over. The hitmaker said doctors have told her that she can have another child, but she would not be able to give birth naturally. However, she said she doesn't mind if she can't carry her own baby again and said she is more than happy to adopt as many kids as she can in the future.